Hi, it's Craig here. I just want to share with you a quick update to my sequence diagram generator application which I showed in a previous tutorial. This time I've updated the sequence diagram generator to support Genesis TLib messages. Okay, we'll just turn real-time mode on. time capture now we just need to capture all the actor traffic so I'll start by logging into Genesis interaction workspace IWS events that have been captured. I'll now just place a quick test call. While that's just running, I should just mention that standard SC generator functionality, uh, e.g. breakpoints and comments and filters, uh, work equally with TLib traffic. Just change my agent status to not ready and then back again to ready. There we go, I'll receive the call that had been in queue, we'll just hang that up. We'll confirm that capturing of all the actors is now complete. You can see them all displayed there within SD Edit. Let's go not ready. There we go, a real-time request agent not ready event between the two actors. We'll place another call. There we go, we get the SIP and the RTP traffic as you'd seen previously. Ready. There we go, an event request agent ready. It also shows the DN associated with the event. We have some SIP messaging as a result. Let's hand, hang up that call. There we get the SIP by message in real time. We'll log out now of IWS. And there we have it, a completed call flow. Just turn capture off. We can review the sequence diagram or the call flow, including Genesis T lib messages in its entirety.